कुछ नहीं एग्जाम्पल नंबर नाइन जैसे एटीन इक्वल टू एटीन आ रहा है ओके आफ्टर सॉल्विंग ऑल दिस तो अब समझ नहीं आ रहा अगर आपको याद हो तो वी हैव डन बेसिक्स लाइक तीन पॉसिबल सॉल्यूशन होते हैं ओके जब हम लीनियर इक्वेशन की बात कर रहे हैं पेयर ऑफ लीनियर इक्वेशन तो पेयर तीन तरीके से बन सकते हैं पहला पेयर इंटरसेप्टेड रिमेम्बर यस सेकेंड पैरल इंटरसेप्टिंग अब इंटरसेप्टिंग का मतलब हो गया ये एक कॉमन सॉल्यूशन है यस मैम और ये कब होता है व्हाट इज द कंडीशन फॉर दिस थिंग पैरेलल में क्या होता है कि इक्वेशंस आर लाइक दिस समवट एंड व्हाट इज द एलजेब्रिक कंडीशन ऑफ दिस a1 a1 अपॉन a2 इज इक्वल टू a1 अपॉन b2 इज नॉट इक्वल टू c1 अपॉन c2 c1 अपॉन c2 वन इज गुड सर नाउ ओवर हियर थर्ड कंडीशन क्या है कोइंसिडेंट लाइन Coincidence, which is like overlapping. Yes. Yes or no? Yes. So, its condition is what? A one upon A two. A one upon A two. B two is equals to C one upon C two. C one upon C two. Now, try to understand the most important part of this thing. It has one solution. Understood. What about the solution part of this? Quickly tell me. In case of parallel lines, hmm. So. In case of parallel lines, no solution is formed. No solution. And in case of coincident lines, infinitely many solutions. Mm -hmm. Infinite, infinitely many solutions. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, this thing should be kept in mind. On this basis, we will discuss this thing. Okay. Okay. So. As we got to know that it is eighteen equals to eighteen, yes or no? Yes. Yes. This is eighteen equals to eighteen. I don't know. Here I said. Yes. Okay. Yes. 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 Yes
So can I? What is the condition of this? What is this condition? Uh, coincident line. How many Infinite. solutions? Infinitely many solutions. So that's it. You have to say there are infinitely many solution for this thing. Mm -hmm. So we cannot have one unique solution. Okay. Understood? Yes. So what they are trying to say, there are many possible ways to buy this combination. Yes. Is this thing clear? Yes. So that is it for applying to these kind of questions. Example number nine is very important. Uh, if you get something like this, 18 upon 18, something like this. So you have to go back to your basics and find out what type of solution is this. Okay. Quickly copy this thing.